Hello. Hello. I know. There's no Lego in front of me, is there? But this kind of Lego in front of me because look what I've got. I've got the Lego Christmas magazine. Oh, yes. From the Lego shop. Ah. Now, I haven't been buying. I haven't. I promise. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through because this is the Christmas Christmas catalogue for 2018 of the Lego shop. And I love Lego. You know me. Just, just look. There's your wish list. So you have to fill that in. That is your Lego wish list. What have they put on already for me? Ah, uh, look through the catalogue, tick your favourite sets, then write them down on this page. You can also make a wish list online. So this one here just tells you about ordering and everything on that bit there. It says you have to order by December the 18th to get it in time for Christmas. Now, oh my goodness. They are the Christmas specials this year. Just look at that. Oh my God. I want the train. I want the train. It's so bad. It's ridiculous. You get so much with it. You do. But it's, well, the Winter Village station is $74.99. But that, you have to get that if you're getting the winter holiday train. Don't you really? Which is also $74.99. So, so that's a bit pricey. Yes. So right. First page. Build to give. Build to give. Every child deserves a chance to play. For many children and families, the holidays can be a difficult time. We want to help by giving 500,000 children in need the chance to play this holiday season. Visit the, visit the store during, during November and December or use your Lego bricks at home to build an ornament, display it in store or share online with Build to Give. For any more ornament built, we will donate a Lego set to a child in need. Cool. So you buy the Lego sets or you build them. If you've got the white and the red and everything. That's pretty awesome. I like that. Okay. I, I, I like these. Now we had these one Christmas. These are the advent calendars. So that one is the Lego City. Which eldest monkey had. Lego Friends. Which mon little monkey had. And then we, I got a Star Wars one. They were a pain. <laughs> they were they were an absolute pain. Yes. It's just every morning before school I had to build three Legos. And they didn't come with instructions on how to build them. But they weren't simple. But I like Mr. and Mrs. Claus. They're cool. They are. Alright, we don't want the preschooler sets. Because we've gone past the preschoolers. I think I'm above that age now. For the preschooling Lego. Yes. It is cool Lego though. Right. What's this? Oh, this is the juniors. They do like the baby sets. The is it Julop? Sets for preschoolers. They've now started doing. Show these. Sets for preschoolers. Then you've got sets for young builders. Now these look like the ones I have. But I don't think they are. I don't think they're as complicated. These are called juniors. Lego juniors. Easy to build. I'd probably still find them confusing. Yes. They've got to be the same as what I have. Yeah, juniors. So then you have your Jurassic World sets. Look. I'm not really a huge... I like the films. The Jurassic Park films. But not really the Lego. Chase the Crooks with Chase. Got your Lego police station and everything. And all your other bits. Oh, the Arctic one. There's a woolly mammoth. There's a woolly mammoth. There's a woolly mammoth. And there's a saber tooth being carried in a block of ice. Oh, that's cool. Oh, there's a little husky as well. Look. That is awesome. Capital City. So, right, this set. Let me show you this set first. This is Pe People Pack Outdoor Adventure. Okay, so you have 14 adult and children Lego figures in that set. That's quite cool. Lego City Hospital. Oh, I haven't seen a hospital before. Oh, I like that. That's new. Okay, 11 minifigures, three doctors, a hospital worker, two paramedics, mum, dad, and three patients, plus skeleton and baby figures. Skeleton? Okay, x-ray department, maybe. Do you get the helicopter as well? 
help citizens in need at the modu modular, modular Lego City Hospital featuring an operating room, x-ray room with a light brick, ambulance, helicopter and 11 minifigures and a skeleton and baby figures. Cool. So you basically get that whole page. I like that. It's £70, £69.99. I was looking at this one, Capital City. Tour Lego City's Capital City Centre including a Toy Story, Toy Story two-story hotel, museum construction site, kiosk charging station, six vehicles, a skateboard ramp with hoop and 13 minifigures. 13! That is awesome. It's £120 now. But that is a cool set. I like that set. I do. Mr. Bedusa likes the trains. Yes, he likes the train set. Me, not so much. So, creative building, Lego classics. They're quite cool. Okay. I seem to have the sniffles all of a sudden. Ooh, we've got marvellous sets, which is the mar superheroes, which is pretty awesome. That one is huge. Look at that. That is proper huge. That is 100. They seem to like the £120 mark. Batman to the rescue. Lots of Batmans. I don't think there's any Harley Quinns there. There's Wonder Woman, Aquaman's there. Batman, The Flash. Don't know who the green guy is. It might be Lex Luthor. Firestorm and the Cheetah. Where's the Cheetah? So you have... Wait there, the Cheetah might be who I thought Aquaman was. Yeah, I think it is. Oopsie. But yeah, there's no Harley Quinns, unfortunately. But you can get the app controlled Batmobile. Look at that. Yes. I like the original Batmobile though. I am I'm very fussy like that. Right, Ninjago. This is Ninjago City. Live the high life with the three level Ninjago City featuring shops, apartments, restaurants, a sliding lift, bridge, and loads more features and functions. There is so much. This would be so complicated to build. It measures over 63 centimetres high, 31 centimetres wide and 42 centimetres deep. Just look how complicated that is. That would take forever. How many bricks? There is 4,867 pieces of Lego. Oh my giddy heart. So this is another Ninja Ninjago one. The city docks. Explore Ninjago City Docks. Ooh, excuse me. With a harbour, crane, grocery store, food display tipping function, house, dojo, workshop, tea room, arcade, and functioning vending machine. That's pretty cool about the vending machine, but look. That one's not as ex well, I think it is. No. That one, the three story one is $259.99. The Ninjago City Docks is $199.99. So we're still in Ninjago land. No, I'm not really huge. We went towards the Ninjago movie, but I'm not really a huge Ninjago. Like, I don't need to collect them all, kind of thing. More Ninjago. Oh, and they have the Ninjago ride, don't they, at Legoland? I quite like the Red Dragon. Well, they always have to make them evil, the dragons, and they're not evil. They're not. I like them in the um, Lego Elves, the dragons. Oh, Minecraft. Minecraft. Now I have some of this to build. I do. Somewhere. Um, so, yes. There's some pretty funky things in Minecraft. Let me show you that one as well. I like the skeleton head one. I don't know if that'd be pretty simple. The Skull Arena. Only 20 quid as well. That's quite cool. So, right, three in one models. I like these. I do. These are Lego creators. So, this one, I've seen this one in Asda. I'm sure I have. Treehouse Treasures. Oh, I'm so sorry. Head out for the pirate adventures with the three in one treehouse treasure set featuring a three level pirate ship, treehouse with a bounty of nautical features. So look, you can build all three of those designs for 30 pound. Or cruising adventures, you build the cruise ship, the docking yard. 
So you build the luxury yacht with a detailed cabin and toilet, plus a beach setting and a surfboard and water scooter. So that's the bottom one. The next one is a pirate roller coaster. So you can build three types of roller coasters. But this one, I love it. The bottom one. I love that. That's the first time I've seen that. Might have to ask for that. Oh, you can rebuild into a beach buggy or a lifeguard tower, but I would have to build the van. I would. And there. Yeah, I would. Ooh. Favourite characters, Lego brick heads. I did a couple of these, haven't I? They were my adult UK gamer. Me building them. I've done Captain America. And I've done someone else. So, great sets for your wish list. Many retiring soon. Oh, no. No way to retire them. I like that. Women of NASA. Oh, I like that a lot. That one in that top corner there, look. That one's cool. Everybody will be liking the Porsche 911 GT3, though. No. I like the women of NASA, 10 or 20 quid. Mission to Mars. Fire station. I think we've got our fire station. Snow resort ski lift. Oh, that's nice. And the farm cottage. All on that page. But I like that woman of NASA. That says two Lego things I'm asking for for Christmas. Sleeping Beauty's Fairy Castle. That's quite nice. And I'm bad for £30. Modular Winter Vacation. Not really bothered about that. Detective's Office. Wow, that's pricey. Ferris Wheel. That goes round. Slave One Star Wars. And the Star Wars Moss Eisley Cantina. So I like that one. So that is that the two things that I said? I think it was. So that so far I've spent twenty. I've spent fifty pound. <laughs> oh no, Star Wars. Oh no, right. This is the biggest one that they do. I think in Star Wars, and I think it's the most expensive. So it's the Millennium Falcon. It measures 21 centimetres high, 84 centimetres long and 56, no, eight, yeah, 84 centimetres long and 56 centimetres wide. It's £649.99 and there's 7,541 pieces. Build, play and display the ultimate Millennium Falcon with amazing external detailing, large cockpit, detailed interior, 7,500 elements and two crews. So it includes seven minifigures, BB-8 and two Porgs. Largest Lego set ever. And then you get the Y-Wing Starfighter at 169. So that's those two. Now I know a lot of people have got that. I do. So Betrayal at Cloud City, one. And we have... Oh my god. The Death Star. The Death Star includes 23 minifigures and two droids. Now that's pretty cool. I think out of that one, or the Millennium Falcon, I'd have the Death Star. I think the Death Star is more prominent. Oh, a Pog! Oh, I like Pog. I like Pog. Imperial AT Hauler. Malox Land Speed. An Imperial TIE Fighter. That's a Pog. Pog, Pog. So that's those ones. More Star Wars. We have Sandcrawler, Cloud Rider Swoop Bikes. Anakin, oh, I've done this one. Anakin Jedi Starfighter. I've done that one. So, yes, I have. We've got that one. And we have a Kessel Run Millennium Falcon. There. Oh, BB 8's cool. And a wing v versus tie silencer micro figures. Darth Vader's castle. I didn't know Darth Vader had a castle. Snoke's throne room and a BB-8. I like that one. I never knew it had a castle though. BB-8. BB-8 is so cute. It really is. Oh, we're into Harry Potter land now. Yes. So Aragog's lair. Oh, that's the spider. Quidditch match. Hogwarts Whomping Willow. I like the Whomping Willow. And then we have the Hogwarts Great Hall. So that's all of them. And then Hogwarts Great Hall is on the back. 
So how many minifigures do you get with Hogwarts Great Hall? Oh, you get 10. Oh, cool. You get a lot of the main characters. Look, on the bottom. That is pretty cool. You get Hagrid, Nearly Headless Nick, Professor Quirrell, Professor McGonagall, Albus Dumbledore, Draco Malfoy, Susan Bones, Hermione Granger, Harry Potter, and Ron Weasley. Who's Susan Bones? I can't remember reading about a Susan Bones, can you? Hmm. Right, so that's the only Harry Potter ones. Then we have, well, it's still Harry Potter. We have um, the Fantastical Beast one here, I think. That looks like Fantastical Beast. Enter a fantasy realm with Grindelwald's escape, magical showdown between Seraphina, Pickery and Grindelwald, featuring an articulated carriage with opening doors and removable roof attached to the thestral figure with wing hinged wings. Cool. Then you've got Newt's case of magical creatures. I think I'd quite like Newt's case of magical creatures because they look quite cool. Then you've got the Hogwarts Express. All on there. Now, on the back of this page is my um hmm what is it what, what do i call it oh my god what do i call it my ps to the della restaurants <laughs> i probably said that all wrong this is um i don't know what you call it but that is oh my god it is the disney castle it's 299 pound 99 there's 4,080 pieces. So, explore the magical Lego replica of the iconic Walt Disney World. Resort Cinderella Castle featuring a highly detailed facade and an array of Disney themed rooms. You get five figures. You get Daisy Duck, Donald Duck, Minnie Mouse, Mickey Mouse and Tinkerbell. But I think I would have to collect all the princesses as well. The Disney Castle features a detailed facade with a stone bridge, clock, wide arched entrance, ornate balconies, spired towers, plus a four-story main building and a five-story gold-inspired main tower, both containing rooms with assorted Disney-inspired features and elements. And it's like, oh my god. Ah, the Disney Castle measures over 74 centimetres high, 84 centimetres wide and 31 centimetres deep. Just look at the rear view. That is the rear view of it. Is it? Is it gone blurred? That is just. <sighs> I need it. Do. Anyway, let's move on. So these are Lego Creator hard to find Lego sets. So first we have the Taj Mahal, and then the carousel. The carousel looks pretty cool because it does actually move around. And then on this page we've got the roller coaster that actually moves as well. Yes. Build your own fairground. Then we have the modular buildings. I quite like the buildings, I do. The Parisian restaurant, the downtown diner, the assembly square. So, yeah. That's the restaurant, the diner, and the assembly square. Now, it says down here, each Lego modular building can be displayed individually or connected to each other. Oh, right. <gasps> cool you can make your own street I'd, I'd buy all them and then I'd have the castle in the middle <laughs> where I live <laughs> how bad is that so these are technics now realistic models heavy duty forklift rally car Volvo concept wheel and a whack and a bash yes there's your forklift your rally car I'm not sure what did I say that was it's a wheel loader and then a whack and a bash. <laughs> these look good. These are challenging building, these are. Okay. Forest machine. Explore innovative engineering with the forest machine. Complete with advanced pneumatic motorization and a host of authentic features and functions. Oh my god, I would not be able to build that. Then you've got the Mac Anthem. Experience the Mac Anthem truck and trailer firsthand with this Lego Technic replica featuring an array of authentic details and functions rebuilt into a replica of the iconic Mac LR Refuse Collection Vehicle. That is awesome. But again, I don't think I would be able to build it. I think it would be way out of my brain to be able to build that. So we have the Rough Terrain Crane and the 
Bugatti Chiron. Authentic details, these are called. So there's your crane. And there is your Bugatti. Bugatti, Bugatti. One of them. Oh my God, it just carries on. So we have amazing vehicles. We have the Volkswagen Beetle and the London Bus. Now on my Lego channel, I've already done a miniature Lego bus, haven't I? And then we've got the James Bond, Aston Martin. It really shows where my head is because I prefer the Disney Castle. <laughs> so start your engines. Oh, I have this one to build. We got it from the London shop. Ford Fiesta M Sport, the Ford Mustang and the Porsche 911. But yes, I got a Mustang Sally. All you gotta do is ride around Sally. So we got the Ferrari Ultimate Garage and the Ferrari 488 GT3 Scuda Corsa. So it's all Ferrari on that page. It is. What else we got? Oh, we got Build and Code. So this is Lego Mindstorms and Lego Boost. Now, I've never seen Lego Mindstorms in action, but I have seen Lego Boost in action. And he was pretty cool. And you can drive him and everything on your iPad. Yes. Oh, I am a VIP member of my Lego shop, of course. And you can give Lego as a gift card. Did you know that? Mm -hmm. So iconic landmarks. These are some that I would like as well as my um, castle. So we've got Las Vegas, Statue of Liberty and Great Wall of China. Las Vegas, baby. Yes. I don't know if I'd want those ones though. Oh, they've not got the others in. They've got some others in the shop. I can't remember what they are. So we've got Tron Legacy. Oh, sorry. No, you go. Tron Legacy and Lego NASA Apollo Saturn 5 on that one. And then on this next page, we've got Voltron and Ship in a Bottle. They're very random because they've done like one thing for Tron and one thing for Voltron. <laughs> now we've got Unikitty sets. Yes, we've got the Dr. Fox Laboratory, the Uni Kingdom Creative Brick Box. I love Uni Kitty. She's so colourful. She is. And then we've got Uni Kingdom Fairground Fun, Party Time, Uni Kitty Cloud Car, and Prince Puppycorn Trike. So there's your all them. But this one, I've got this one, and I've built this one on my Lego channel. Yes. So check it out. Now we're into Disney magic. Oh my god. There's one here Cinderella's Dream Castle, Ariel's Royal Celebration Boat, and Rapunzel's Travelling Caravan. Didn't know how Rapunzel had a travelling caravan. Oh yeah. I like them. And then we're on to the Lego Friends now, I think. Heart Lake City Resort. Little Miss is too little for Lego, Lego Friends. Yeah, it's all Lego Friends at the moment. We're into Andrea's Accessory Store, Friendship Box. Ooh. So this Friendship Box, right, it features five buildable life-size Lego Friends accessories. A microphone, camera, trophy, walkie-talkies and a robot. Okay. Then you've got a Heart Lake City Pet Centre. Everything a girl needs. And you've got Maya's Camper Van and is it Mia? Mia, Mia's Treehouse and Mia's Camper Van. What what is that one doing? What what is that woman doing there? I'm not entirely sure. Not entirely sure no. More Lego friends. We've got Emma's art stand. I like that. Olivia's mission vehicle. Friendship house. The big race day and creative turning sh tuning shop. Okay. And I think it feels shiny. Yep, yeah, that's my lot. On the back, though, we have Hogwarts Castle. This highly detailed collectible comes with packed with highlights from the Harry Potter series, where you will discover towers, turrets, chambers, classrooms, creatures, the Whomping Willow, and Hagrid's Hut, plus many more iconic features. And with four minifigures, 27 micro figures featuring students, professors, and statues, plus five Dementors. Cool. Oh, did you get the dragon? I bet you get the dragon. 
and then you get the dragon. It's three hundred and forty nine pound ninety nine. It's always in for ninety nine. Look at that though. That is amazing. And Hogwarts Castle measures fifty eight centimeters high, six to nine centimeters wide, and forty three centimeters deep. It's of the Wizarding World. So yes, there we go. My lovely Lego catalogue. Hope you've enjoyed going through it with me and seeing what I would really like for Christmas. <laughs> so like the video for me, subscribe to my beautiful channels and follow me on Twitter, Instagram and Patreon all at the amazing Adele Sexy UK. Don't forget, if you're on my Lego channel, go look for watch the other videos. I make some cool pieces, yes. And keep an eye out for future videos. Subscribe to it, then you'll get notifications, hopefully, of when my new videos come out as well. See you soon, guys. Goodbye. I'll get my clicker clacker. See you later.